finance ministers of France and Germany have kicked off high-stakes talks with U.S. officials to underscore Europe's concerns over U.S. President Joe Biden's ambitious climate action plan. The aim of the meeting is to discuss the impact of the Inflation Reduction Act on European industry. Green subsidies and tax breaks provided in the U.S. Act have raised controversy and given rise to friction between the United States and Europe. In the latest, U.S. officials and the French and German ministers have agreed on the need for full transparency on green subsidies. My understanding and my, um, my interpretation of the talks is there is a huge willingness to find, without opening the IRA, forms of cooperation. Cooperation means not to separate markets, but to bring them together. And this is uh, of mutual benefit. The United States is keen to reduce dependence on Chinese imports, but the EU is concerned about the collateral damage of the companies that are enticed by the U.S. subsidies to relocate outside the bloc. The European officials are worried about the way the financial incentives under the Act are designed. Brussels is now pushing Washington to make exemptions under the IRA for European companies. Echoing similar concerns, the French economy minister said that Europe aims to score a deal whereby as many European companies as possible could benefit from the provisions of the U.S. Inflation Reduction Act. The second point is uh, to have uh, the maximum of European components being included in the framework of the Inflation Reduction Act so that they can benefit of the tax credit and of the subsidies that will be given to American products. I'm thinking of uh, electric vehicles, I'm thinking of electric batteries, I'm thinking of critical materials and we share the view with uh, Robert and with the European Commission that there is a possibility of uh, building an alliance on critical materials between the US and Europe so that we could reduce our dependency on critical materials. The latest visit comes after French President Emmanuel Macron's trip to Washington in December. U.S. President Joe Biden had incredible, said then that the IRA never intended to disadvantage U.S. allies. Our two nations... Thank you so much.